this is my uh, Corona build for 2020. I built this uh, board at home, sitting at the house, wanting to do something. So I built another quadcopter. This is a long range. I have the Free Sky R9M Mini uh, receiver. Got a Cadex uh, Rattel uh, 2.1 millimeter camera, I believe. If not, it's a 1.6. Lens on there for FPV. Have the CL Racing LEDs. Have a uh, capacitor in the back with a Wi Fi buzzer, lost alarm. Use the uh, Joshua Bardwell um, ESC and 4 in 1 flight controller. Have a uh, Ishin Nano VTX tucked under there with a lollipop antenna from UR UAV. And then I got the Flyvu motors here. As we can see that here, these are the twenty-three hundred six point five. I think that's seventeen fifty KV. Yeah. I didn't have any uh, TPU protectors or anything for the frame, so I just put some uh, super glue around the frame. And then I layered that with uh, liquid electrical tape. So I'm um, going to try to avoid flying over this over hard surfaces. Just out in the actual field, long range, over grass and dirt. So hopefully uh, the frame will hold up. I tried to order two of these. But this was the last one left from uh, Get FPV. This was the last one available. So I went ahead and snatched that frame up. And I'm sure uh, it's due to the coronavirus. We got a lot of shortage on parts for drones now. Everything's on back order. But luckily I ordered most of my parts before that even hit. So I had plenty of parts. Uh, the frame is the only new part on here. Everything else I already had. Just uh, in my inventory. So we're going to go out and do a test hover. And I will let y'all know how that goes. Once again, this is my iFlight. Um, XL7 V4 frame. And I'm going to use the Avon, Emax Avon 6 inch props on there.